Now, if you want to consider if a molecule is polar or not, it's a little bit trickier, right? But I mean, see the same concept. Oh, a basic example, so carbon dioxide. Is this, is this molecule polar? Well, in this case, we're going to look at uh, one covalent bond at a time. Okay. All right, start with the CO bond on the left side. So you know that uh, CO bond, so oxygen is more electronegative than carbon. So the polarity, the dipole moment of this bond will pull to the left, right? But now CO bond on the right also pull to the right. Right, so two polar bonds but opposite direction. Now, if you look at the whole thing, is carbon dioxide polar? No, non-polar. They cancel out the offset. You know? Right? Now, in uh for water, right? So you you know the polarity of each bond go toward oxygen, go toward oxygen. Right? So the whole thing will go point toward go up to oxygen like that, right? On the if you uh, if you break the if you divided um this vector, like go to physics a little, uh on the x axis, point to the right, point to the left, they cancel out. But the one that on y axis point up, point up, they add up. So go toward oxygen. Okay. Now aluminum uh, trichloride. So aluminum chloride. Is this molecule polar or non-polar? Well, same thing. Look at one bond at a time. This bond here, pull toward chlorine, pull toward chlorine. This bond, pull toward chlorine. They all cancel in the middle. Okay, so this is non-polar. Alright. Um, now let's try. So alright, so this structure is a little bit weird. So we have a uh, bromine on the x-axis. Oh, so, uh, on the y-axis. On the x-axis, we have bromine, bromine, bromine. So this one kind of point toward you, this one point this, uh, away from you. These three bromine are on the same plane, right? And they're on the same plane. All right, so um, the two bromine, P, uh, PBR to the, uh, to the top, to the bottom, they cancel out, you know? And this guy right here, it looks like a planar. It's on, a, it's on the same plane, right? So one point... And they, uh, they all uh, point toward bromine, so they cancel in the middle. So the whole thing is non-polar, right? So only water is polar so far. Now, uh, SF6, right? The top and bottom cancel out, you know? And we have fluorine in the in, on the same plane right here. So it looks like it's like a square, pl square plane like that. They all pull toward fluorine, so they cancel in the middle. So this molecule is also a non-polar, right? So the polarity of the molecule depends on one: do they have uh, is is there any polar bond in the molecule? And two: do all dipole moments cancel out cancel each other out? So you have to watch for that. Okay. All right. Now class activity number three. So question one, two, and three, and four, and five. It's five. 